Geo explanation. The Yellowstone caldera erupt. The Yellowstone caldera, also known as the Yellowstone supervolcano, is a massive volcanic depression measuring approximately 50 kilometers by 70 kilometers, 30 miles by 45 miles. Located in the west central area of Yellowstone National Park in northwest Wyoming. The word caldera comes from the Spanish for cauldron, and this deep crater covers most of Yellowstone National Park. Yellowstone's caldera is over 640,000 years old, and is the youngest of the three largest calderas in the park. Around 66 million years ago in the Cenozoic era, extensive volcanic activity, glaciation, and widespread mountain building shaped the region. This includes the formation of the Abasaroka Mountains along the park's present-day north and east sides. About 16.5 million years ago, a period of intense volcanism began near the present-day Nevada, Oregon, and Idaho borders, causing widespread volcanic eruptions. As the North American plate moves southwest over a shallow body of magma, a 500-mile imprint of more than 100 calderas has been created. Usually, calderas form after the collapse of the top of a volcanic cone, or group of cones, due to the partial emptying of a magma chamber during a major eruption. There were three more major eruptions in the Yellowstone area, two of which ejected more than 240 cubic miles of magma, magnitude 8, the highest rating on the volcanic explosion index. The earliest major eruption, the Huckleberry Ridge Tuff, occurred approximately 2.1 million years ago, and the eruption of Mesa Falls about 800,000 years ago. The eruption of Lava Creek led to the formation of the Yellowstone Caldera, 640,000 years ago. This eruption caused a large amount of hot volcanic rock to spread outward. Hot ash, Pumice and other rock fragments collected and stuck together to form thick sheets of hard rock. Volcanic debris from this eruption covered most of the continental US, with some material found as far away as Louisiana. The magma probably lay only 3 to 8 miles under the two domes that reappeared in today's Yellowstone caldera the Sour Creek Dome and the Mallard Lake Dome. The two domes can expand and contract as the volume of magma and hydrothermal fluid shifts between them. Over the past century, the bottom of the caldera has tilted southward due to net inflation, causing trees on the south bank of Yellowstone Lake to stand in the water and sandy beaches to form at the lake's north end. Yellowstone occurred about 70,000 years ago, when rhyolitic lava flows erupted. As a result of the largest currents, the Pitchstone Plateau in southwestern Yellowstone National Park was formed. According to the Yellowstone Volcano Observatory, the most likely activities at Yellowstone include hydrothermal explosions, eruptions of steam and hot water, large and moderate earthquakes, or lava flows. Lava flows are less severe than eruptions that cause calderas, with lava slowly flowing off the ground over long periods of time. 